Edge, a redshirt junior from O'Fallon, Illinois, a transfer, and there's a three-pointer coming off the bench from Zach Irvin. His concerns about perhaps some of the officiating. Irvin from the left wing. He is not covered, but he will splash it down for his second three-pointer. That's. It. I don't have his phone number, by the way. <laughs> That's okay. And there's Lotto Morris with his first tray as he is knocked down in the process. He has five. Ball. Eight to shoot. Wooden will shoot it now. And drops down the three-pointer. Nowhere to go. Spins, takes the shot. Tough got it. Is, and here comes Amani flying in from left field. I'm going to try to run it down here. Here's Morris, slides in, throws it high over everybody's block attempt. That was almost an own goal. And here comes Amati, powers his way through. That's the way the Dukes end the half. There's Urban. Sule tried to get out there on him, but it was too late as Urban has his third three-pointer. And the Phoenix have recaptured the lead. It's Division Three Randolph of the Old Dominion Athletic Conference. And here's Amati with another dunk. Not quite as authoritative, but still one good enough. Fake runs into some difficulty. Ian Nacho through the crowd. Leads it for Wooden. No slam it in. Phoenix have a chance to take a lead. Phoenix have not led by any more than two in this ball game. And they have that lead once again on the finish coming from Graham on the nice bounce inside. Inside. Hannah. All net on the little hook shot for Hannah. Just pushes it out. He's going to drive, step back. That's a two, and it's way shy. And Edwards has the board for the Dukes. He'll bring it into the front court right away. Moore steps into a three-pointer. Yes, it is good. Burford, three to shoot. There's the three-pointer. Big, big shot there for Darius Burford. Well, quite the ball game here tonight. But once again, the Dukes come up a bit shy. 70-66, our final.